Okay, I'm back for part two of um, my Lime Crime review. This is Duchess. Duchess is a blue with with a gold undertone, giving it that blue green look. Okay, see, that's Duchess. My birthday is in March, and my birthstone is the aquamarine. This is to me, mermaid is the perfect, the best. Ooh, a little too much. The best uh, blue green you will ever find, in my opinion. It is like the perfect blue green. Not too much blue, not too much green, but the perfect combination of blue green. That one was mermaid. Gorgeous. My favorite, favorite, favoritest, favoritest, favoritest green in the whole white world. Uh, no, I should say the my favoriteest light green. Hello, <laughs> my gorgeous son. <laughs> He's my baby man. <laughs> See, this is my the perfect light green. That is Elf. That is a white with teal duochrome. It is Snow Queen. You can tell that didn't close right. You gotta be really careful. If you don't close these right, they'll, they'll spill. Uh, this is Princess Caribou. Princess Caribou is a beautiful, beautiful exotic green. You can layer it. Now, Xenia, just use a base herself. If you feel that you're not getting the intensity you want, you just put a base underneath. And this is Enchant. I love it. It's a black green. I love it. It's a black green. Right next to Princess Caribou. Alright, her glitters are the best glitters I've ever tried. They are so finely milled. They go on so, so nice. This is called Jinx, and it is the perfect complement to her mermaid. I mean, it looks exactly like her mermaid. My wrist, I couldn't get the blue off from before. Yeah, let me put on a little bit deep, better than that. Let's see if you could get a, her, um, her glitters are the like the best glitters I've ever tried. My hands was hurting me, uh, so I'm going to switch to my underarm. Oh, well, the under part of my arm, not my armpits. So this is, I think this one's called Voodoo. That's her green glitter. Beautifully, finely milled. They just complement her eyeshadows. That's Voodoo. And this is red. Nice red and green to use for Christmas. Awesome. Red. Glitter. And this one is called Transylvania. Get it? Dracula, blood. This one's called Black Magic. Ooh, that's real nice. It mixed with a little bit with the with the red. Ooh, pretty. Now I know. You can layer these. That's the black glitter. And then I got unicorn. Which is the blue one. Isn't that pretty? That's the unicorn blue. Very, very pretty. I, I can't even describe the way these things shimmer and just enhance the eyeshadows and complements her eyeshadows. 
Black Magic. This is Unicorn. This is like a magenta color. I'm going to put that right here. It's a pink, a blue toned pink. I guess you could call it a fuchsia pink. I'm going to break my back doing this. Don't do that. <laughs> ah, there you go. Purple. Gorgeous. Alchemy. Purple. I just love these colors. I love the glitters. They are so finely milled. It, it doesn't look heavy. They're not chunky. These are fine, very, very finely milled. I safe glitters and they complement their color her colors beautifully and um, you put it on the color and instead of looking like you have glitter it just makes the the eyeshadow sparkle because it blends so well almost like like an eyeshadow it's just it's just so gorgeous I got circus girl there you go, Circus Girl. Treasure Chest. Cleopatra. Like I said, I always get one orange in honor of my daughter. Um, and I swatched them on my hand. Let's see if you get it. Now, um, Treasure Chest is just a a golder, deeper version of Circus Girl. Circus Girl is the very yellow color, but it still has like a golden tone. And Treasure Chest is a gold, but a yellow gold. And this is foiled up here. Let's see if you can. There you go. See how it sparkles? It's foiled. And then this is um, Cleopatra. And I was always looking for the perfect yellow gold eyeshadows. When I was a young adult, I found some in some makeup bazaar in Brooklyn, New York. And everybody complimented me when I wore it. And this, I love this, is the exact colors. That's my review. Love, 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 love. If you can't wear orangey gold colors, then these are the yellows and golds for you. It's like a, a yellow with a little bit of golden tint, and then that's a, a gold, but a yellowish gold. So there you have it. Have I'll have all the pictures up for you, and just remember the pictures are without a base and without foil. Foiled gorgeous base it intensifies the color Zenia uses base herself so okay well I hope you like this review I hope this helped you and I think honestly that they're prettier than max pigments <laughs> okay bye <laughs>